Okay, what's good, y'all? It's your boy, Greg the Duke. I'm trying to make the video again because this thing keeps dying and all kind of stuff. So, I went to the Apple Store today. Almost got ugly. It was... It could have... It, 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 it would have been... It could have been potentially bad today. Do you hear me? It could have been bad, okay? My MacBook was messing up today, so I called the Apple Store to make an appointment. Um, I told him my, my MacBook wasn't working. He was like to telling me I can go online to make an appointment. Of course, I'm like, well, I can't go online to make an appointment because my MacBook is not working. So he was like, well, I'll be scheduled. I'll be happy to schedule you an appointment. Um, when would you like to come in? I said, well, what do you have available? He said that they are free all day. So I'm like, well, okay, what do you have then? Well, what's the earliest y'all have? He was like, I don't know what time it is. I said, well, it's 10:50. He told me that they are free at 11.30. I can come in at 11.30 because ain't nobody in there. They're free all day. They looking clear. They looking all good. Cool. I'm there at 11.30. So grabs Bernie up, which is the Mac. I grabs Bernie Mac up because he been tripping. He really been tripping. And I grabbed Bernie. Jumps in the car and I'm like, well, should I get some gas? Or should I just go ahead and chance it? And I'm like, well, no, I ain't going to chance it because I'm not really sure since I haven't had this car too long, I don't really like to chance it because I ain't trying to run out of gas because it's cold outside and I don't want to be stranded on the side of the expressway because people drive crazy. And, you know, it's slick and stuff because it snowed last night and I don't want to, you know, whatever. So I get to the Apple store, go to the guy with the iPad and, you know, I was like, hey, I got an appointment. Sure, what's your name? Give him my name and he does not see me in the system. What's your last name again? My last name is, what's your last name again? Your last name? So now I'm thinking he's trying to be funny because I do have a very different last name. I'm thinking he's trying to be funny or something. Oh, no, I'm sorry. I mean your first name. Okay. Well, I don't see you in here. Are you sure you got an appointment for today? Uh, yeah. I just called about 30 minutes ago and talked to someone. He told me that y'all didn't have, y'all was free all day. It wasn't a lot of people in there. Which, of course, when I get in there, it's so the hell out. You know, I'm thinking maybe Jay-Z and Beyonce decided to come in and you know, get their MacBook worked on or something because it was that many people in, in the store. And um, so he was like, well, I don't see you in there. Just go stand over there and, you know, we'll get it worked out. So I'm like, cool. You know, normally, you know, I don't really have problems in there. This did happen before, but I'm thinking, cool, they're going to get it worked out. So I'm like, well, I guess while I'm in here, well, maybe I can get on block TV or something to kill some time. It, you know, it would be a different scenery, you know. And, um... I go on Facebook, reply to some comments, and, you know, check my blog and re reply to some, you know, messages and stuff on there as well. I look up, and now it's 11.50, and no one has come over to say anything to me. Well, this guy came over, to, you know, to, to tell me that Brent was going to take care of me. But that was 15 minutes ago. So I'm still standing here looking over. Maybe every so often they will come to see everybody around me is getting helped. Everybody, are you okay? Are you, how you doing? Everything's good. That's the new, do you have Lion? You know, do you have the new operating system? Do you know what iCloud is? Ain't nobody saying nothing to me. So, I'm, you know, I'm just, you know, I'm cool because I'm trying to be content. You know, I didn't answer all the messages that I could and all this stuff. And I'm like, well, let me go see because now it's 12 o'clock. So, I've been pity patting around this Apple store for 30 minutes. And I'm not new to Apple, so nothing in the store is amazes me. You know what I'm saying? If you have, I mean, I already have everything in her. So, I mean, I'm not, you know, ain't no new product out there where I can play around on. I don't, I mean, I'm not, I'm not amazed with none of this crap. I have it already. Except for an iMac, I don't have one of those, but I got everything else. I don't have an iPhone either, but, you know, I have an iPod Touch. So, I goes back to Brent. Um, have you found anything out yet? Oh, yeah, uh, hold on real quick. I'm going to go and ask him and see. So he goes and asks him, comes back. Oh, yeah, he'll be right with you in a minute. Um, I said, so what did you find out? He'll be right with you in a minute. So what did you find out? Oh, he, oh he, he's going to come and talk to you. He'll be right with you. Oh, you can just go stand over there. And now I'm like, okay, if somebody tells me to go stand somewhere one more time. So then the dude comes over, and, you know, he's asking me what the problem is and blah, blah, blah. And I'm telling him. I've been in here. Point was 1130. You know, whoop de boop Now, you know, I'm a... MacBook ain't working right. I didn't in here, you know. I had an appointment. And he's asking me who did I talk to. I don't know. Same thing. Well, I sit down right there, and I'll be right back. Now I'm pissed. I'm like, if somebody tell me to sit down, I go stand somewhere one more time. It's going down. I could be, you know, I'm just because I had an I had an appointment, you know, and um, 
then he goes to the back and, you know, tell me he couldn't find an appointment. He's going to get somebody to diagnose me. Then he comes over and tells me that there's five people ahead of me, but they'll be right with you as soon as I take care of the other people. I'm like, well, then they're not going to be right with me then. Because if there's five people ahead of me, after all of those five people go, it's going to be my turn. And on average, if it takes 30 minutes with each of these people, it's not going to be until 2 o'clock. And it's 12.05. Yeah, I know, but we're we're, we're trying to do our best to accommodate you. You're not accommodating me because you're not doing me no favor because my appointment was at 11.30. So you're not doing me no favor, bruh. My appointment was at 11.30. I'm not about to wait for you to help five people. And then one dude is in there talking about, um, he had four bars this morning on his cell phone, and now he only got one. And I'm supposed to sit here and wait? Hell no, I'm not doing it. And now I'm pissed, okay? I'm pissed. It's about to be angry black men in the Apple store. And I don't want to be the st- stereotypical, I don't want to fall into the stereotypical role, you know. But I'm pissed off. They talking to me like I'm stupid. They telling me to go sit here, stand here, go there, all this shit. It's about to go down up in this Apple store. Because in, in a couple more seconds, I'm about to start throwing iPads, MacBooks, iMacs, iPhones, iPods, all of that shit, okay? I'm about to go off, for real. So I'm sitting down there, and I'm like, you know what? I'm, 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 I'm thinking to myself, I'm not waiting for no five people. I, I I need to talk to a manager. I need to talk to a manager. Because they're acting like I'm lying. I need to talk to a manager. Manager comes over. I tell her my frustrations. How I have a lot of work I have to do. Um, I need my computer. Um, I had an appointment. Y'all got me all in, wasting all this time. 2 o'clock is coming soon and I'm going to have to get home. I don't have time for this. I don't. You know, this ain't cool. It's not cool. And I'm like, damn, I just know it. And then, you know, my vision started getting blurry and shit. Damn, I can see it now. The video gonna be viral all over YouTube. Title: Angry Black Man Goes Off in the Apple Store, and you just gonna see shit all flying everywhere, which way, and iPads and all that shit. So, so she gets someone right away, cause you know she goes and talks to somebody. She gets someone right away, and they tell me that my appointment was they accidentally scheduled it for. Tomorrow, and there's no way that I was even in the system because the guy would have seen me in there somehow when he typed my name up. I'm sure, and um, and so he, you know, she she gets someone. He looks at my computer, and I tell him what the problem is, and he said it sounds like it's a hard drive failure. And now I'm pissed because I'm like, but I have an Apple. I'm not supposed to have a hard drive failure. And, she, and he was asking me if I backed up, and I'm like, no, I didn't back up anything. And I'm even more pissed now because I just. You know, I've been learning these HTML codes and stuff like that for my blog. And all my HTML codes and different little things like that are on my hard drive. Everything. You know, I didn't I didn't back up nothing. I didn't think I had to. I mean, I haven't even had the Mac that long, like a year and a half. I'm like, damn. He was like, yeah, I'm thinking it's the hard drive. And when he turned it on, this time it comes on the Apple loaded. But, you know, it still wasn't uh, working or whatever. So he was like, yeah, I think it's the hard drive. And they asked me if I backed up, and she's like, you know, you should back up. And this, this ain't a good time to tell somebody that they should have backed up their shit when their computer's fucked up. And she's going, you know, she's asking him what's the best external hard drive for, and he's asking me what size hard drive I already had. And he was like, well, I think two fifty five hundred for two fifty. I'm like, if this motherfucker try to sell me a damn external hard drive, what the fuck am I gonna do with it now? So she comes over. Cause I, I didn't vent, I didn't vent it to her ass, telling her all this stuff, and I was so ready to call corporate, which I know they want to did shit, especially after seeing the little story on how they do the people in China. I'm like, man. So she comes over with this hard drive in her hand, and I, I'm looking at her like, and she was like, well, you know, this is my gift to you because you know I know it's frustrating sometimes, and yada yada yada. And I'm looking like, for real? She was like, yeah, because, you know, you, I know you've been through a lot today and blah, blah, blah. I'm like, really? And I'm looking at the back. I'm like, 1995. And I'm like, 1995. I'm like, really? I'm like, you're giving this to me? She was like, yeah. And it's, there's the price of it, y'all. 1995. I'm like, you're giving this to me? She was like, yeah, because I know, you know, You've been through it and blah, blah, blah. So Apple totally redeemed herself today. She was a very nice manager, and I really appreciated her. My computer's going to be in there for about five days. But, yes, they gave me this free hard drive. And, yeah, so my time is running out. So thanks for watching, y'all. Talk to you later. Peace.